Rock and roll, live, in the studios of Triple J with the Hummingbirds, Alana and Simon, doing a Ramones track, I Want to Be Sedated. You're going to play your new single now, which hasn't been released yet, a couple of weeks, is that right? Uh, 17th of June. Is, is out? It? Yeah. Yep. Right. It's next, Very soon. Yeah, two weeks, hence. Yeah. Comes off the new LP, Va Va Voom, which we've been waiting for for some time. Indeed, we have been so have waiting we. for a while as well. <laughs> Why did it take so long? Is it just a case of you... Uh, it's those old gnomes in Zurich again, you know. Just, <laughs> those three people who dictate the uh, the way the world runs just decided that we couldn't get an album out for another two years, you know. So. Yeah, it had a lot to do with the fact that you went overseas for an extensive yeah. tour and yeah. you went overseas to record the LP as well. Do you want That's to tell right. us about that? Uh, well, lady? We went to Charlotte, North Carolina to record Va Va Boom. Wow. With Mitch Easter again? Wa Wa Boom. Yep, indeed. We... Uh, <laughs> It, it's actually just as cheap for us to go there and record it. It was in that instance, as far as I know, not that anyone showed me a piece of paper with lots of zeros or, or anything. I don't particularly want to see the bill, actually. Definitely not. But uh, we just wanted to get away and we wanted to have a bit of an adventure. But uh, I think we've learned from our mistakes as far as timing is concerned and uh, we're working on recording our next album now so that it can come out a lot sooner. Uh, this one has come out. And I suppose first. working with Mitch Easter again, of course you worked with him on Love Buzz, yeah. is uh, good for continuity. <coughs> and he had a fair idea of what you were trying to achieve, I gather? A uh, much greater yeah. idea, yeah. We, um, the advantage we're doing, sorry, two records is that you, the first record you try, kind of uh, establish your relationship and then when you go back and do the second one, well then you know how you relate to each other. You can just go ahead and do it without any little power struggles or anything, you know. Great. Now, this new song, Two Weeks with a Good Man in Niagara Falls, is it from a movie title somewhere? It's got something to do with movies? <coughs> yes, it has. It has. It has a lot to do with To Catch a Thief. By uh, Alfred Hitchcock, starring Cary Grant and Grace Kelly. I knew it was in the back of my mind somewhere. Yes, it's, a, it's a line that Cary Grant says to Grace Kelly at some point in the movie. And I just, actually, I, I was watching the movie and uh, I think... Uh, Ohio or somewhere, I was actually on the road with the Let's Actors, <laughs> believe it or not. <laughs> Name dropper. Well, yeah, it did, I wasn't invited, I just kind of came along. <laughs> it was either that or leave me alone. At the home, mascot. You know? Yeah, so, and that movie was on and then he said what he says and it stuck in my mind so I wrote a song about it. Wow, That's, inspiration. 
Uh, yes, well, it has to come occasionally, you know. It makes you feel better when it's it does. Just as well, really. <laughs> yes, if it doesn't, then you're, you're not getting anywhere. Well, let's have a preview of the brand new single for the Hummingbirds. This is Two Weeks with a Good Man in Niagara Falls. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Long live summer day, but you're not saying anything. I thought I knew you. What did I know? I'm your ability. You got some company in mind. We'll all be linked to. What is that? tuned to Triple J on the Sunday sessions. I have Alana and Simon from the Hummingbirds. Last track now, a track called Dragged Over the Coals. What's the history behind this one? Revenge song, I think. This is one of our, yeah. another yeah. one of our <coughs> famous revenge songs. Yes. This song is, uh, was written by me purely out of spite for a band that I was in that I was thrown out of for being a middle class. That was my crime. They were called the excerpts. <laughs> This is when you were and young and impressionable. Of Andrew, Steve, and Charlie. <laughs> Thanks, guys. All three God. of which <laughs> How are, are, they're very nice people. people you know, I'm actually glad they threw you out of the band, Simon, to tell you well, the that's truth. Nice, but, you know, at the time, <laughs> at the time it was hard sure. to deal, deal with. The song tells the truth about what actually happened. I just think that uh, all of us make, uh, make decisions which are morally unsound. And uh, in this case, it was my responsibility to, to share the knowledge that it was unsound with these three people named Andrew, Steve and Charlie. Before we go into it, I suppose we should give you a bit of a plug where you're doing uh, doing a few record launches, aren't you? The first one is next Saturday, the 15th of June in Sydney at the Phoenician Club, along with Sea Stories and Splash. Yes, $5 you're also to doing... get in. Just, Sorry, $5, $5 to get, get in. in. I have to push that angle. Cheap at half the price. Exactly. And you're doing two record launches, is this right, in July in Melbourne? Just uh, the one? Uh, You're doing two gigs, though, yeah. anyway, at the Central Club and Brewster's in Essendon. And, of course, we'll uh, let you know more about that as days well, go on. Yeah, I mean, I would consider the record as having been launched, given that it will be the first time we will have played in Melbourne since the record came out. That makes sense. Might as well make it a record launch now. Yeah, what well. the hell? <laughs> you know. Might as well. And, it. of course, you'll also be doing some dates with the Lemonheads when they come to Australia later on in July. <coughs> sure will. Yes, that's true. Should uh, be fun. Mm. More fun for some than others, I should expect. 
Okay, we won't talk about that. We'll just let that one go over everybody else's head. And I should thank you both for coming in <coughs> to the Sunday sessions today. Thanks, Alana. Thank you. Thanks, Simon. Thank you. And we'll go out with a track from the Hummingbirds, Dragged Over the Coal. See you later. Bye. See you. they recorded earlier with Mitch Easter in South Carolina.